Welcome, I'm Denis Boucher. Weight loss is based on the functioning of your metabolism and how it distributes and uses your body's energy reserves. Unfortunately, weight loss has for decades been viewed from a strictly mathematical perspective. Thus, as one pound of fat contains 3,500 calories of energy, it is therefore considered that spending through exercise or reducing one's caloric intake by 3,500 calories will result in a loss of one pound of fat. You have therefore been sold this concept of weight loss in every which way possible by your mother, your father, a cousin, friends, as miracle diet, program promotions, name it. And this belief is very deeply entrenched in your mind. You believe it so much that you cannot even imagine that weight loss may work differently. This mathematical model of weight loss that is so deeply rooted in people's mind to the point of becoming a popular belief has led to aberrant behavior. This belief leads you to spend, through exercise, the highest possible number of calories and to reduce your caloric intake as much as possible. In short, to meet the requirements of this belief, you train to exhaustion and constantly suffer from starvation. If this mathematical model of weight loss really worked, you wouldn't be here listening to me right now. Yes, in the short term, you will see some weight loss using this model. However, since your body is pushed into a situation of physiological stress after a few weeks, your metabolism will slow down in order to spend as few calories as possible. It will also store more fat in order to generate energy reserves in the event that you would imperil your body for a long period of time. So, this is how you become resistant to weight loss. Is this what you really want? I'm Denis Boucher. Thanks for watching. See you in an upcoming episode.